five, if you don't mind, we'll take a look at uh, Protective Stadium. And uh, <laughs> that's live. I think the, uh, <laughs> our team may be uh, fixing to come out here pretty soon. All right, lots of folks looking around. You can see them behind those very intimidating, we hope, laser eyes <laughs> about to break through. All right, WVTM 13's Guy Rawlings has been watching the excitement as we are. Some of the players milling about right now. Explorers searched uncharted lands. And uh, Guy Rawlings and Ryan Hennessy there. Guy, are you hearing us out there? Yeah, I'm, I'm hearing you, but I'm also hearing the roar of the Blazer inside the stadium. There were fireworks out here. Uh, the game is about to start. It was a huge party out here uh, just minutes ago, but as, as uh, Adam zooms into the stadium, you see people starting to find their seats. It's an exciting day, and it's kind of crazy if you think about it, Jeff, because just a few years ago, there was no team. They had to bring the team back. And now they got all this? It took the whole city to get the program back. You know, anchor Brittany Decker sat down one-on-one -on -one with head coach Bill Clark this week. She asked about the journey to bring the program back and build the stadium right behind us. Okay, well, instead of hearing uh, Brittany's conversation with head coach Bill Clark, you see the team coming out into Protective Stadium for the very first time. This is one of those moments that I'm sure those kids, those coaches, these students, the staff here at UAB will never forget. All right, Ryan Hennessy joins me now, and and uh, the atmosphere it's unbelievable. is is unbelievable like you said and just the whole rebuilding the program absolutely and just to see this whole place packed right here this road just closed down it was so cool to see i was talking to some students that were juniors so they were here sophomore freshman year and this is not what they had and they just said this is so cool <laughs> this is so cool to have this and what a night it is hopefully the weather holds up the rest of the night because it was raining a little bit earlier but an exciting night overall guy yeah so we're we're gonna be out here uh, throughout the night and throughout this newscast it is really exciting outside Protective Stadium uh, for the very first time and uh, for many times to come, Jeff. 